Starbucks released a new drink and it's making people shit their pants and it has my full curiosity. <laughs> it's called the Oleato. <laughs> Why do I want to try it though? But why do I want to try it? <laughs> if somebody sends me $5, I will take one for the team. Is I don't know. Hold on. Is $5 even enough for coffee anymore? I looked into it and there are three versions of this olive oil coffee and one of them is hot, which makes sense because, you know, coffee has oil in it and oil is what makes it taste really good. But two of them are iced and um, oil looks like this when it's cold. Ew, like why would, ugh, why would you do it like that? Like Starbucks, are you guys okay over there? what are you doing why would you why would you make this but i but also why do i still want to try it so i will if you guys want to make me shit my pants i will go get one but you have to buy me a cup of coffee because i am not going to pay for this i'm not i'm not going to pay to go shit my pants i can't do it i can't make myself do it when all of my pennies are devoted to taking care of my brand new baby i cannot be sending some to starbucks for something like this but if you guys are curious, as curious as I am, I will try it. I will try it for you. Uh, <laughs> there are links in the place that links go. Uh, I love you guys. Bye. If you guys want to make me shit my pants, I will go get one. Well, if you guys didn't know, I live in the middle of nowhere in the Upper Peninsula of Michigan, and they are currently not serving oleato lattes up here yet. So I have some olive oil, and I got what I needed to get. We're going to make it here at home, and I'm going to give it a shot I got an iced one and I got a hot one just so I can try them both and have an honest opinion on it. I'm going to try the hot one first. I'm going to drink them both. Like you guys paid good money to make me shit my pants and I'm, I'm going to give it the best effort that I can. Fun fact, after you have a baby, you get to be constipated for an indefinite amount of time and I am in the full throes of that right now. So as much as I'm not really looking forward to the potential effects of drinking two laxatives times two, I'm also kind of looking forward to it i don't know man i would not order this one on purpose the hot one it's not so bad but ugh, i don't know the oil just leaves a nasty taste in the back of my throat it does not match the taste of the coffee so let, let's try let's try the ice one i'm nervous about this one i'm curious how long it's going to take for the oil to congeal at the top of it but you know so far it oh hasn't done that yet but it, it does not look good it, it tastes terrible i'm gonna drink them both and i'm gonna give you guys an update and however long it takes for me to give you an update but like who would who would think this is a good idea look at that that looks so gross looking forward to some relief so you know we'll see how it goes okay bye like you guys paid good money to make me shit my pants and i'm i'm gonna give it the best effort that i can let's just say that it worked i feel like a new person colonoscopy prep could never a little bit about me so you can find out whether or not this will have the same effect on you just in case you need it i do the whole one meal a day thing and i eat really high protein and high fat so this didn't exactly destroy me but it definitely moved everything along at top speed as you can tell from the earlier clip it wasn't exactly the most comfortable thing that's ever happened to me before but now that it's all over and i've had a nap i feel amazing i will never ever ever with my own money or somebody else's ever walk into a starbucks and order that again that iced coffee with the oil on top was foul i shook the hell out of it before i drank it and none of the oil congealed like it did in that one picture so i'm kind of curious what the difference between their oil and what i had is but it, it didn't do that thank god God, it. but a hundred percent trust your Nona because she knows what's going on. Olive oil is definitely a lack. Starbucks really was like, how can we punish everybody for all of that secret menu garbage? And they've done it. They've they've found a way to make us shit our pants.